Time for more foxhole fun times. This time we're going to do something a little closer to the front. I think we'll start here at the baths. It's a little bit closer, so uh, might cause a little bit more of a disturbance. We're going to be doing the same thing. Pulling out the power lines, hijacking all the vehicles, and locking them, and emptying the fuel. This is the most efficient way to troll, because we can get away with it quite a while without being detected. First things first is we grab a wrench, which there are no wrenches here, so I've got to go find one. Off to a good start here, for those that don't know that haven't seen my channel. We go to the power poles and we disconnect all the cords. We take anything out of the vehicles we can, drop them on the ground. Take the fuel out and then lock the vehicle, dumping the fuel also on the ground. This causes a lot of headaches for people trying to do things in this game. Uh, this takes a very long time to undo all of this, but it only takes me a second to do. So I still need to get a wrench so I can break into the locked vehicles and then lock them for myself. Because that means someone else will have to wrench them open like I do. Also, if anyone leaves construction materials in these vehicle things... We can just make random vehicles with them and uh, waste the materials. Although there's someone nearby. Also, if you ever see this little thing, this is a cement mixer, concrete mixer. Dump everything out of it. You just wasted hours and hours of someone's work, especially if this despawns. I don't honestly know if items on the floor despawn, but it is such a pain in the butt to reload that thing. Found an entire construction yard with tons of vehicles, emptying the fuel out of all of them. Taking the power poles, disconnecting all the wires. Oh, it's so good. So much destruction. And uh, sometimes the vehicles are uh, are locked. It looks like, what is this? Yeah, I've already taken care of that vehicle. You can see that I dumped the fuel on the ground there. Dis disconnecting the power poles. Also, the train, tr train thingies here. These can be locked and unlocked, so I'm going to lock every single one of these containers. And, of course, dump the coal on the ground so that it can't function. Again, this is just... Very basic juvenile stuff, but it really, really adds up in the long run. There we go. And then, of course, lock these. And for, for some reason, these don't make a lock sound, so you can do this stealthily. And then, of course, I see a power pole with um, wires connected to it, so you know me. Gotta disconnect it. Gotta disconnect all the wires. No one's allowed to have electricity ever again. We're going back to the Stone Age, baby. Uh oh, someone's like, why are you dumping fuel uh, from the cranes? So Bidgey's isn't all, he's been banned eight times. Banned eight times. <laughs> Only eight times, guys? All right, that is one entire, just a hex, just black and just completely disconnected. All vehicles locked, all fuel removed in every single one of these towns. And of course, the chat is wilding about it. I reported good luck. Uh, Benji, you can defend yourself. Just report them. And uh, <laughs> the thing is, is like, once you have this many bans on your account, people just assume that you're the bad guy, even if they don't catch you in the act. Because I made sure to do this when no one was around. But, um, you know, just removing fuel, I guess there's a log for that. So someone checked the log and like, oh, why is he pu putting fuel on the ground? Hmm? A little weird, isn't it? <laughs> oh, when I see a big tangle of power lines, I just, mmm, it feels good. Because you just know that someone put a lot of work into wiring all of these up. It is going to be a huge hassle to redo. And yes, there's people nearby, but hey, it's whatever. I'm on borrowed time anyway. The world chat's already crying for me to get, you know, everyone report me and stuff. So I'm just going to pull as many plugs as I can until I get my little tent ban or perma ban. Or it's whatever. I don't really care. But we must do as much damage as possible with the time that we have. And if you find a concrete mixer that's on and has a lot of concrete materials, just dump them on the ground. This is huge, huge time, huge waste of time uh, for them. And there we go. Just dump them all on the ground. And this is hours and hours and hours wasted. Oh boy, yes it is. Very good. It does take a little bit of time though to, to take care of everything, but... Uh, possibly if I jack a truck and park it next to it, it could be faster, but this is still effective because it's just dumping it all on the ground, uh, which is a really annoying way to pick up. And you can see someone spotted me doing it. They just ran down. I might say something in the voice chat, but uh, like I said, I'm already on borrowed time. So there we go. He's, he's not saying nothing, so... <laughs> uh, he might shoot me. I hear him loading a gun. Yep. 
Well, I got a lot of damage done, so... <laughs> oh, he's picking me up now. What's he gonna do? Press E to give up? Yeah, okay. I'll just give up. <laughs> uh, funny stuff. Everyone reports will bid you! Uh, lost connection to server. We, I can't read the chat, but this guy was like, I just found him dumping my concrete. <laughs> That's fucked up, Bidgey. <laughs> oh, man, I love it so much. It's too fun. All right, I'm going to force that guy to defend his concrete. It was right here in Sun's Hollow, so that's where I'm going to spawn. I had to reopen my game because it wouldn't load for some reason. <laughs> Let's get him. <laughs> well, guess not. That's a, was that, a three-day bad? <laughs> yeah, man. Oh, this game is too fun. So, I've only been playing Foxhole for 23 hours, and I have nine bands on my account now from this game. Oh, man. And they're all automated bands. They're, they're, they're not manual bands. It's just being reported too many times by clannies. And, uh, you know, I would, I would like to actually enjoy the game, have people to play it with, but um, there's just no way. There's just too many clans, and if you don't do exactly what they want, they, they vote kick you out. They vote ban you. That's why I'm griefing this game. I am getting revenge for everyone that's just like me, all my fellow solo players. I am taking it upon myself to seek and get revenge on those that would wrong us solo players who don't want us playing the game they want it to be played as. And if you look at the negative reviews of this game, it's all almost the exact same stuff. It's um, banned for being mass reported. Um, there's also the devs don't communicate or they make stupid patches. But most of it is people that were banned because they were mass reported, which is, you know, what, I've, what I went through long before I started to grief this game, okay? Uh, let's see. All these, uh, I would prefer to leave a neutral review. The, the game itself is great. The community is not. Um, <laughs> oh, this is, uh, again, I can just keep scrolling forever. Look at all these. Just negative. Not recommended. Not re recommended. Like, this guy's a thousand hours. Not recommended. 88 hours, not recommended. 80 hours, 20 hours, 160, 120 hours, not recommended. 1,559 hours, not recommended. And uh, it just goes on and 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 on. It just never ends. Well, I guess it ended here. So there you go. And if you look at the Steam forums here, you got trash, game died for solo players. Here's my thread. What a fun new player experience. Okay, it's got 164 replies of people trying to defend the game or sharing, um, you know, that they agree with me. Continuing on, let's see, um, <laughs> uh, you gotta go to the subreddit for more of the salt, because they do delete a lot of threads. I'm a YouTuber, so they're not deleting mine, I guess. Like, here's a fun Steam thread of some clanny, you can see he's got his clan tag in his, um, in his, uh, Reddit name. You know, complaining about players, and if you click the image, it's just someone that's been banned 689 days ago. It's like two years ago, dude. And and this this guy's, you know, whatever, right? And they're, <laughs> whoops, didn't mean to go back there. But um, people complaining, oh, there needs to be a system in place to get rid of these players, these griefers, wah. and they're all clannies. Every single person that's saying it is a clanny. Oh, we got a we got a little um a little after the ban image here from someone on the Steam forums. Okay. Uh, the pirate guy, uh, who was the one who shot me just a bit ago, said, All base builders, careful of players swole bidgey. Found dumping concrete in my base, instantly left region. That's because I was banned. Uh, known griefer already in our Discord. Caught three times. <laughs> I have. I clipped. Yeah, he is known griefer. How, how soon be? <laughs> well, anyway, that's the video. I'm swole bidgey. Thanks for watching. As always, be a bro and stay swole. I read every comment, so make sure you leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe because I got videos every single day. There's a link to the Discord if you want to help me grief games like this or other games in the future. Lots of fun times ahead for all of us, okay? Also, there's a video on the screen right now. Go ahead and click it because it's a good one. And if you want to donate, you can click the Thanks button or the Join button to become a channel member. Uh, make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss tomorrow's video. Take care, lads.